In this video, we're going to go through an example of a constructible workflow with Quadri. We're going to take design data from Civil 3D, bring it into Quadri, and then push it out to Trimble Business Center for any necessary adjustments to either bring back into Quadri or to push out to machine control. So on the screen right now, I've got a large project in South Devon. To get the data in and out of Quadri, we need to create something called a design task. So at the connectors tab at the top, click on design, and when you get various templates with Civil 3D, Rhino Grasshopper, Tetla Structures, Trimble Business Center, and more. I've already created these tasks, as I'll show you now. We've got three that we're going to use. So I'm going to start off in Civil 3D. Now we can see that I've got a design open that includes an alignment and a road corridor. And that road corridor has associated surfaces, um, such as your datum, your shoulders, and your daylight surfaces. And in order to send this data over to Quadri, I go to the Quadri tab at the top, I select the design task that I've created, press OK, and then select the objects that I want to send over. So in this case, I'm going to send over the center alignment, I'm going to send over the corridor lines, some of the associated surfaces. You can also select objects by pressing the button below. Now I've selected those, all I need to do is press send to Quadri. And what this will do is connect directly to the Quadri application on your desktop and send the data through API to API. Now that's done, I'm gonna go back into Quadri, like so, close out of this view. And if I go to the design task I created, we can see I've got 73 new features in that. If I right click and view in 3D, we can see the road model has come through with the alignment, but we notice that the daylight surface on the left side is missing. That's because I removed it in Civil 3D and we're going to create the surface tie in Trimble Business Center instead. In order to connect to Trimble Business Center, we use the same process where we create the design task and then we go over to Trimble Business Center. Now I'm in here. If I go to the Quadri tab at the top, I select a task and press OK. Now I need to tell the task what data I want to pass across. So if I open it up in Quadri, I select my task, edit, go to my calculation basis, and select the tasks that I want to send over. The tasks that I want to send are the Civil 3D 703, and there's all the associated features that I'd like to send through. Now back in TBC, if I select Receive from Quadri, it will bring through those surfaces. And there they are. Now in order to make the surface tie that we want, we're going to bring across the OGL as well. But we don't want to bring across the whole thing, so we'll just do a section. And to do this in Quadri, what I want to do is go ahead and view this in plan. And then if I go to my design task containing the OGL, go ahead and select my ground model. And I want to clip it by location. So if I click location, add location shape, and then I simply will just create a rough polygon around the alignment and press enter and close and then finish. Now in Trimble Business Center, if I select that new task and press OK and then receive from Quadri, we can see that it's brought the OGL through, clips to the location. Now in TBC, I want to go ahead and create a surface tie as it didn't have one in Civil 3D. So I go to surfaces at the top, surface tie, give an appropriate name, I tie it to my ground surface. Put the reference line and fill out the rest. And I'm going to add it to a new surface. This time. It's okay. Apply. And then we can close out of that. Now it's created this surface type surface. So to pass this back through to Quadri, 
we'll go to the quadri tab at the top with it selected we need to select our task uh, I'll go ahead and put surfaces and then send to quadri let's close if I go back to quadri close out of these views now if I open up that task that I just pushed it to we can see that I've got that surface tie there and if I were to drag and drop it we can see that I've just brought that surface tie from TBC into Quadri. This was just to show you how quick it can be to alter designs done in Civil 3D and the like in Trimble Business Center getting them ready for construction. Considering that I already have a cohesive bottom surface as seen below then it means that we can push it straight from TBC out to Works Manager for Machine Control. In order to do that, if we go back into TBC, go to our construction data, create design, give it a second to connect to the project, press OK, and we'll give it a design name, 73. That was construction. Press OK. I'm going to go ahead and click change model on there and select road surface. I'm going to pass along the alignment through as well and change my surface to the data and press OK. Once I've done that, I can add setting out points or a design map that I won't bother. And it's as simple as pressing publish. And this will generate the file that you need for machine control and send it off to the Works Manager Cloud where it can be pushed to your machines. Thank you all for watching.